Well, it's no wonder people are walking away from Tony-nominated and Emmy winner Eddie Izzard's solo performance of Hamlet in awe. Eddie plays 23, yeah, I'm going to say that again, 23 characters in this production, all while taking on the very complicated prose of William Shakespeare. And lucky for us, Eddie joins me now. Welcome. Good to see you. Thank you very much. And I should say that if people love Shakespeare, this is for them. But if people are new to Shakespeare or have been wary of Shakespeare, this, this is, is for also them. for them. Because uh, my older brother, Mark, he did the adaptation. We did Great Expectations last year in New York, yes. and that got rave reviews. And he's cut down from four hours to two hours, and he's made it very accessible so that the through line is, is found. It is, it is honorable to all of Shakespeare's writing. The poetry yeah. is in there, but some of the extraneous stuff is, is dropped it's away. It's left out. So it's, it is the, the main through lines of the eight main characters is there, and you can see it beautifully, even though it's just It's just me. you. But th So the run was just extended. Yeah. Was that some, like a complicated decision to make? Because it, it has to be grueling well, for can you I say, It's it. extended, but also transferring. We're extended at the Greenwich House Theatre, selling yeah. out, and we're transferring to the Orpheum Theatre. Yes from the 19th of May, um, and so a bigger theatre, and we're moving on. It's just New York is saying we want to come, and so we're moving on up. And yeah. did you say the question was, was it, is it tricky it, to... It, what, no, I was saying it has to be such a grueling show. Like, how, how, it how hard grueling. was it for you to say, yep, let's keep doing this? No, well, I love it. I mean, you know, when I was seven, I wanted to act. I literally saw a play, yeah. January uh, 1970. I was eight, sorry, I was eight. And I thought, I want to act, and now I'm a little bit older, and uh, I'm doing Hamlet, so what's yeah. not to Love, and the people of New York have said this is wonderful. Yeah. So I'm going to keep doing it in New York. Then I'm going to transfer it to London, and then I will play it around the world. Oh I'm going to write God. it to the stars. But so this this is two and a half hours. I think, I'd say two hours on stage. Two hours on stage interval. by yourself. Twenty three characters. How do you even? This is not the first time you've done it. Like you said, you did Great Expectations last year. You did twenty one characters in that. But how do you even prepare for that? Like how much time do you give yourself till you're ready? Well, I I think the rehearsal period took me into readiness. It, it was weird. When I started reading Hamlet's Lines, uh, when I was doing, we were doing open rehearsals. We were inviting the audience into open rehearsals, which is very unusual, yeah. doing Q&As afterwards, saying, what do you think of this? So um, I felt very at home with Hamlet. It's a real workshop. But also, it's, it's, a, <laughs> it's a real workshop. There's also Ophelia and Gertrude in there, and the female characters being a trans person. I wanted to be honorable to male and female yeah. characters and land them all with 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 uh, their, with good arcs uh, yeah. uh, for their characters to travel in. Well, yeah, you 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 go from character to character really subtly, but the audience never gets lost oh, in the show. Go. And so, I mean, do you have to almost have a trust in the audience to do a show like this? I, I assume their intelligence and I assume their imagination. That's it. Yeah. So if you have very little imagination and very little intelligence, do not come. It's yeah. not for you. But the people, the, the good people of New York, they just, you know, they, their minds are switched on and they can see what I'm doing. And I, there's a certain architecture that I do as I move around the stage. Um, it's why I, don't, I never want to act it out in, in a live interview because yeah. it, it, I can't understand what can't, you're doing. Like, pick it but in the when middle, you come yeah. in within within three, two three minutes, you you get what I'm doing, and it works, and people just keep coming back. So I'm and coming second and third times. That's the that's the yes, thing. Yes, I know. I mean the audience too. I mean this is not a typical Broadway audience. From the people that I know have been to see it, and I cannot wait to go see it, have said it's like the audience that's there is such a mix of people. Like doesn't look like a regular like Broadway or off Broadway crowd. It's like probably some of your Stand up audience. Well, I too. think it's 9 to 90. I mean, it is a serious play. There are, there's the Gravedigger scene. He has a comedic character. Rosencrantz and Guildenstern are quite comedic. Polonius is quite comedic. So Shakespeare does lace his comedy in yeah. amongst the, the dramatic lines of Ophelia losing her mind, of Hamlet treating her like hell. And him not doing what he's supposed to do. His his father turns up as the ghost at the end of Act One. Yeah. He doesn't kill Claudius until the end of Act Five. Spoiler alert here. Um, but <laughs> it's 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 a long. It, it, I think it's because it's become so amazing. Uh, uh, the, the reputation of Hamlet yeah. is because it's, it's it's written in an unusual way. It's it's essentially delaying and delaying and delaying. Yeah. But it takes you through his mind. And maybe I think Shakespeare's character is Hamlet. I think that might actually be William Shakespeare. You have on to understand stage. this on a whole different level. Level to be able to play every character. I wish we had 10 more minutes because there's so much more I want to talk to you about, but we have to go. You can see Eddie in Hamlet now through April 14th at the Orpheum Theater. Visit eddieizzardhamlet.com for more. Thank you so Thank much. You. I can't wait to see it.